कमी हो गई ना ये Chanti make her bag below. Mm -hmm. Bye bye, boy. Mama, you sort the rope, sort the paper, and you can. Tomorrow, no, I'll catch you. Ah? No, I'll catch you all in the last game. So, move back. We're trying to watch. So what Auntie Yali is doing is she's hand making a bilum, which are handmade bags um, unique to Papua New Guinea. You mainly find this in Papua New Guinea. They're called bilums. Mm -hmm. And Yali is trying to make a purple bag, a yeah, purple mixed with what color? Serena, please move your hand. Purple, black, green. Purple and green bag. No, Serena, please. Purple and green bag. Yes. Do a two and a two plus eight. No, four. Two plus two equals four. Okay, let's watch as she make her bag. <coughs> so that blue rope is for a guider, like to guide <coughs> that blue rope here. Yeah. Mm. Blue plus rope and blue one. Where? I mean, blue plus. Blue plan the strong in slab, you must look at him starting. Okay. And the starting. Now I'm rope was short now. Oh, okay. So you are needing new plan? Yeah, I'm not going to plan now. I'm handle the bilum or? I'm bilum. Base. Ask the bilum. Oh, okay. No, Serena, move your hand. No. Okay, see, Auntie. What Auntie is doing, you are going to learn to make to a bilum. Yeah. Because your grand. Grandma and great great grandparents, and <coughs> it's our culture to make bilums. So, Serena, you will learn. You watch Auntie make the bilum, and you learn. Did you hear me, Serena? Mm -hmm. Can I destroy a little bit? Of yeah, not now. Later, when we'll find some find some of the rope, rope. No. wool. Ah, it's made from wool. Wool or string. Wool or string. The string and you see. Yeah. Auntie Sandy teach him. Who teach who? Yeah, Auntie Yali. <laughs> and she's just starting off the balloon, but I'm going to show you what some of the balloons look like. So watch till the end of the video to see some of the balloons, which I actually have a collection of Papua New Guinea handmade bags, which are called balloons. No, Serena? Yeah. So they usually roll the wool on their thighs <coughs> so that it it what twist out or becomes stronger or what the below wool it becomes stronger. And she's just starting off a new bilum. I actually watched her make a bilum before that. Usually takes how many weeks or so days? Depends. Ah, how many Who's days? Me working. Okay. You go at the half, make it. Go at the half, make it. And that's why we're making a pin to my hair. No, no, no. Okay. You think it's one week? One week. Two weeks. So Yali is my house help, and when she's free, when all my kids are sleeping, she makes bilums, makes her handbags. Even if she goes to her house, she will continue doing this bag, and it can it can take her a week to make. Depends. Depends on the time and her workload. So if she's not busy, then she will spend time making balloons. One week. Auntie Sandy teaches. No, Auntie Yali knows how to make her own bags. Four days. No, Auntie Sandy. One week, two weeks. Mm -hmm. So now you're rolling the rope. Because your rope is not even now. Uh, short. Oh, no, it's short. So she has to make the rope longer in mm -hmm. order to continue the building there. So the building has just started, and 
um, just stick around I'm going to show you what a balloon looks like and these are just handmade out of the needle what what kind of needle is that where do you get your needle from umbrella needle. oh it's from umbrella so they mm -hmm. customize their own needles made from umbrella um, there's a part in the umbrella which is like a needle wait show us the needle Shame the needle yeah so that this part here mm -hmm. hey please i'm done lily no come look <coughs> here oh yeah so that's like the needle that you make this is the actual needle from the umbrella they break it off the umbrella and then they make they use it to um make a billow it's like knitting i think yeah ah, knitting but this is different and in the past i think how old great great grandparents blame me make it so below me below me you see her no need all you see one before uh, yeah also some people okay learn okay also okay learn hunter song so now we're using needles in the past mm. they use their own hands to make this and it's actually quite unique the bags you only find them in Papua New Guinea but I believe some places in Australia that I've seen in uh, Aborigines community they also make billons too and I'm not sure about I think Irinjaya um, on the other side of Indonesia Irinjaya they also make billons too but it's so unique different you have different sort of balloons from Papua New Guinea and they're so beautiful I'm going to show you soon in this video so just stick around to see while we just watch Yali try to make um, the wool to knit the balloon so she has to roll the rope first before she can actually go ahead and start knitting knitting on this side here yeah because her rope is short Fen, Oh, the fan is on. Yeah. No, it's okay. Leave the fan on. It's going to be hot. She can do it. She knows what to do. So, how many, how much the billum you are keeping is? Plenty. I'll just ask you how many billums you've already made. She said she's made a lot of bags. Plenty, me working big, little, small man. Sample buying a long time. So me also planting. I miss all the planting. Okay. Mommy, one day can you tell us the only to make one little, little lot of bag? Okay. Okay, I'm going to show you what balloons look like after the end product of this. What it would look like. She hasn't finished yet. She just started. 